are back to the oh my god why is that music always so loud there we go we are back today playing more um sky the modded let's play i did a couple more mods one of which i think you will like are you there dear? Take your hood off. Whatever it is. No. Let's get that down. Um, I also added a quest mod and something else. Let me check how to use the other thing. I'm not sure if it's a spell. No, it's not a spell. So yeah, back in a minute. Okay, to access both of these things, I think I need to actually teleport somewhere. Because one is a quest mod and one is a companion. Oh, I need to restart my game, it's doing this weird thing. Two minutes. Okay, I think I have fixed it. Yeah, I have. Um, so I need to teleport, apparently. So, what about him? Oh, I've not discovered scam. I'll just travel to the stables. Because the quest mode that Kulia needs to come to me. So I might. Take a while, I might wait like 24 hours. Oh, there's one of them. This thing should follow me. Yep. Yeah. Just a, a nice little worm follower mod. Do you know what? I'm not keen on that massive thing. is not alive yet but hmm? take a look oh, I can sell sky more anus munchers sell a lot don't they oh, I don't want to sell the grand wanking stone if I'm gonna get 1.6 from it This asshole was a vepo. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to do. Let's see here. Looks like that's it. Got to go. I think there should be a letter. I hope this letter finds you well for Sky the Mot of the Wind and the Great House Hallo Halalu are in need of just things. A grave threat from my homeland from all the wind has migrated to Sky them and I thought and for I nip. And though I nip at its heels, I fear that I cannot bring it down alone. Please if you can if you care at all for this land and her peoples, meet me at the slipping giant inn and devil wood as soon as you can. Okay. Kajita's wares, if you have coins. Kajita's wares, if you have coins. Goods and wares of all kinds. Uh, the road makes this one weary. Okay, don't be a creepy bastard. Mm -hmm. I need to go to the wood. Come on. Let's actually drop my FPS a wee bit. Quite a lot, actually. Hopefully that will fix. 
Can take me to any of Where do you want to go? No, it doesn't take me to the woods. fine. I'm gonna have to walk. Brilliant. See ya. The river was just, just along here, I think. So this, I might cut this down actually, this walk, but I say I might, I'm, I mean I will, so see you when I arrive in uh, the wood. Oh god, what's going on here? No. Well, that certainly didn't last long. I've just arrived in the wood. I think I lost um, a little land and just going down there. Ah, it's unkillable, so it should return to me. Okay. So we look for the end. Feindall thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling you. Keep your hands to yourself. I will kill him. I don't like him. Oh, I can see it. Come on. Little lamp. That's it. He's a bit derpy, isn't he? So, let's... Oh, God, I've just dropped something. Two minutes. The ale is going bad. You're that visitor been poking around. Oh, I remember she's got some. Time to push my seat in a bit. I mean, it's a lot of stuff sitting at my feet. So it was here. She got faint. you sent for me so I did dragonborn hmm. amazing you possess so much power and no one could tell by looking at you back to business as neighbors Skyrim and Morrowind share more than a border our fates are intertwined we must look out for one another as such when a famous criminal from Morrowind was spotted in Skyrim I was dispatched by House Hlalu to find him. However, he is too deadly for me to face alone. I need a hero's help. If it is a matter of justice, then I will gladly help. Excellent. You are as noble as they say. Nonetheless, I would feel guilty without rewarding such valor. Five hundred septums awaits you if you succeed. Five hundred. That's not the enough. Criminal a lot. To a village southwest of here called Little Vivek, but after that, trail went cold. However, you may have better luck. Not only is he a fearsome combatant, but he is silver-tongued. If he begs for his life, do not believe a word he says. I'll bet I get Wait, started. before you go, take this ring. The criminal is known to wield enchanted blade. Happy hunting, Dragonborn. And many thanks. You are doing both Morrowind and Skyrim Fire. a great service. Good to see you again. This is all this I will link this quest line in the description. Um it's all custom voice acted. I wonder if this guy will buy some more stuff. Need a room? Talk. Let's sate that appetite. Hmm? No, he only buys my anus munches, but he buys them for the value, so. I only. It's not that. He's only got 800 gold. Eh, mm -hmm. 100 gold, so. So, let's go to our journal.
But before I leave, I want to kill Sven. Because I don't like Sven. There we go. Top notch. Oh god. That was close. I think it's the dark elf that lives here. Yeah, Fender. Wake up, Fender, you asshole. Oh, yes, I'll let it But yeah, I'll be adding more mods in the episodes and taking away mods and such like. I know it's like a woodcutter, so maybe it's... Try not to set anything on fire, alright? Fine. Calm down. How far is this little Vivek? It's actually not that far. I'm getting this is two minutes. I've just found a bandit camp, so I didn't say camp. Yeah. Damn late, you submit, asshole. No bother sounding there. There shall be no mercy, only death. I they all like the physics in this? Like not sarcastic or anything. Actually kind of sarcastic in a way. It's like guys, mod physics I love, one of the reasons I love TTT is because just how real the physics are if you shoot someone in the head with a rifle how their body is flung is very lifelike and almost scarily lifelike especially it puts you in like a weird third, per third person view who's this? Anise, hello Anise I'm just a poor old woman dear no need to trouble yourself with me it's tough just scraping by out here but I make do doesn't look like you're making do at all. Feel bad for you, my niece. Anyway, wait. No, there's point stopping. I'll. Yeah, start recording again. Once I've arrived in Little Vivic. I've just arrived in uh, Little Vivic. Again. All of. The um the NPCs here custom voice acted. Why hello there. What can I do yeah. for you today? Anyone prefers the village lady. Oh, of course. We get visitors every now and then. You should ask my husband if you're looking for someone. He just adores talking to visitors. 
I'm Zelina Rakwasi. You've probably already met my husband, Belvedere. He so loves treating all of our visitors. Good job at annoying, aren't you? Of course, dear. I'd be happy to. But you really should ask Belvedere. He'll have so much more to say. Oh my god. Belvedere, Belvedere. I would go talk to Belvedere if I could actually find him. Some of these knows in stands by something there, uh, God. I'm going to turn on subtitles for you because I'm that nice. Dialogue subtitles, general subtitles, and turn up voices, all voices up. Just turn music. Actually, maybe um, turn effects down a bit and footsteps. Test this. So put, put my FPS down. Shit comes. Just turning that volume down. Hello. Um. I'm you? Albert, and this is my best friend, Meat. Say hi, Meat. Me and Meat are playing Apocadips. See, the whole world was Apocadips by giant mushroom people. And now me and Meat have to save the world by finding the three dogs! God, you're annoying. Yeah! Just find my three stuffed dogs and give them to me, and then we can stop the apocalypse. Hmm, lots of custom quests as well. Can't be asked doing that just now, though. You can just get to hell. Welcome to Salisa's Trade House. What can I do for you? Oh my god, sure. it sounds like an Take infomercial. I'll sell you. Oh, for god's sake. Why do they all have, like, such little money? I'll even buy some of your stuff if you want, but... I mean, really, you shouldn't just be that stupid. Oh, wait. Welcome back. What can I do? I'd run a pretty unsuccessful business if I didn't. Why do you ask? I'm afraid I can't help you. Sorry. I have a strict policy of customer confidentiality. Sorry. I'm a merchant, not a mercenary. What's for sales on the shelf? No more, no less. God, everyone here's a bit annoying, eh? She's she's an infomercial. That wee boy out there is just that wee boy out there is just like from um Cartoon Network. That woman's obsessed with her husband. Not even met her husband yet, mind you. Something you need, traveler. Who are you? I am called Balran. I hunt and fish for the village. Do you know? Interesting. Yes, though few of note. A curious question. More curious from a stranger. Oh, you're such an ass. I can. Because we are a village of Dunmer on the water, and some found it clever. To name it after another village of Dunmer on the water. I do not. God, he is boring. Lady Salise Andrithil and Albert live in Salise Trade House. The twins share a home. 
and Lady Valina Rathvasi lives across from the twins. Belvedere is also there, I suppose. So he doesn't go on with this Belvedere person. This is Belvedere. Ah, what's this? A new visitor to Rathvasi Canton? Welcome, welcome. As I'm sure you know, little Vivek's namesake consisted of floating structures called cantons connected by bridges. Right, so I'm just sorting my headsets. It's hurt my ears. Lastly, it is only natural to call our islands cantons in their honor. It's just so wonderfully fine, traveler. You could not have. And I would love to oh, answer shut up. my friend. Many fine travelers have graced our halls. Are you so Oh, I'm getting invaded. Well, Two well, minutes. No, one I gentleman who passed through. Naturally, I took his armor as a sign and offered him the position of chief ordinator of Little Vivic and my personal aide. That thug Baron must have offended him. He spent entirely too much time. I'll be back in two seconds. Guest.